Since January 1st, the Oilers are the second best team in the NHL with 61 points in 41 games. It's remarkable. And here's one I'll throw your way. Heard this conversation driving in when I was listening to 1260. Um, they talked about Woodcroft being a coach of the year candidate. I don't see it happening this year. I think Jim Montgomery in Boston's got that thing on lock. Yeah. I think Bruce Cassidy in his first year with the Golden Knights, battling through those injuries as a very good candidate. Maybe he's on the same level as Woodcroft. Pete DeBoer, first year in Dallas, getting them to the level they are. That's great. Dean Evison in Minnesota has done great things with a roster that, you know, is $12 million short of other contending teams. Lindy Ruff. Lindy Ruff in New Jersey. They booed him in the home opener, yeah. and then they made the playoffs. Like, Lind my three, that's a good one on Ruff. I would probably have Montgomery, Ruff, Evison as my three, or DeBoer, one of those two. But, like, Woodcross, I don't even think he's in the top five, if we're being honest. He's a great coach. I love yeah. him. Since he's taken over, the Oilers are the third best team in the NHL or something last year. So, yeah, I love him, but I don't think this is the year he gets coach of the year. Uh, not trying to discount him by any means, but it has been a simple year for Woodcroft in a yeah. way like there's not been many big injuries like we've had the goalie issues where Campbell hasn't been great but besides that like mm -hmm. this team's been pretty rock solid for most of the year but yeah then you look in Boston and some people said they weren't going to make the playoffs um and then it was a bunch you're of you're watching stuff. Fitzpatrick about to shoot that's why you're all thrown <laughs> off <laughs> so they weren't going to make yeah. the playoffs and like Minnesota had all these cap issues and all the one of the best and then obviously just being a new coach in a new mm -hmm. situation so yeah, I don't think this is Ward Cross year, but he's been 